All right, guys, this is it, my brand new house. Welcome to the official house tour, house reveal, the new phase rug house. Guys, I don't even know. I want to get right into it. I don't know what to say. Thank you guys so much for your support. I've moved a few times in the past few years, and I feel this home is the one for me. It's super homey. It's extremely nice, and we just got to get right into it, man. This is where we're going to take the content to the very next level. We have so many ideas. Without further ado, are you guys ready? Let's go. Are you ready? I'm I'm ready, bro. Dude, I'm always so nervous for these videos. I don't know why. Okay. First off, wipe your feet before you go inside. It's just crazy because this is literally the new chapter of my entire life. And you're going to be here for a while. You're not going. You're not I'm going not late, Guys, I'm not selling this house. I'm not moving back in with mommy and daddy after two months. Okay? <laughs> Welcome to the new phase rug home. This entranceway is absolutely stunning, bro. Like, the main thing that I love is the double staircase, of course, and I just love how modern this house is. Black and white all over. Look at the flooring as well. This part is wood, this is tile. It's just so aesthetically pleasing, and the lighting in here, everything is beautiful, and I feel like that matters a lot with my energy. Like, if I wake up to a bright home, I'm just gonna be more uplifted throughout the day. Walking into this house just makes a grand entrance. That's what I love. So, all right, which way you want to go first that room yep it's crazy because this has one of the craziest features in this house this is an office room but if you could look to the right there's a lego wall bro this is so sick it actually came with the house i had to pay extra for it from how crazy this is so you're gonna open this up and there's a spaceship in there with a solar system like you can see all the planets in there dude <laughs> What the heck? You guys are gonna be seeing a lot of art throughout the house. I'm not gonna go through each one, except for the ones that mean a lot to me. Let's enter this room. Ooh. So this is gonna be an office. I haven't gotten the desk yet, but I just love the black brick wall. With this painting, it makes it pop like crazy. You wanna turn the camera right there? Bro, Bro guys, so you thought the Lego wall ended there? It goes into this entire room. And as you can see, it's literally built in the wall. Like, this is legit right here. You wanna see the coolest part about this? Wait, this is not it? It's not over. You ready? Bro. What the hell? This is the coolest thing I have ever seen. We got them growing plants in there, which is cool. And there's more. You open the bottom part and look at that. I just can't imagine how long it takes to do this. The person who actually made it, his name is right here. I don't know how to pronounce it. Can you read that? I just want to give this person credit for creating this Lego wall because it's absolutely beautiful. And then one more. We got... The treasure room. Look at Dang. that, dude. What the hell? This is definitely one of my favorite parts of the house. 100%. We're going to close it up, and we're going to continue with the tour. Should we show them the address now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go out real quick. Let's go this way? Yeah. All right. So this room, I haven't done much to yet, except for this giant Drake painting. Everyone knows this was from my last house. Drake is my favorite rapper of all time. It already came with a TV. I added a few accessories, but I don't know what I want to turn this into. I'm going to be asking you guys a lot of questions and what you guys think I should do, but my vision right now is to kind of turn this into like a gaming lounge where I have like bean bags, a PS5, oh, you know, popcorn machine, something where like all my friends can come over and we can just chill, play some 2K. Oh dude, we're gonna enter one of my favorite parts of the house. And I'm gonna say that about everything. <laughs> But here is the official living room and kitchen. Bro, this right here is the cleanest thing I have ever seen. Look at this island. Matches the floors perfectly. It's super clean, super bright. I don't know, I have to show off this candle because it's lit. It's actually a Fruit Loops candle. Dude, that smells so good. <laughs> smells exactly like Fruit Loops. That's crazy. So as you can see, this is very, very plain and simple, but it's beautiful. Like the black cabinet with this marble top makes everything stand out so much more. I feel like there's too many cabinets though like I'm not gonna use most of them guys look what's back look what's back my touchscreen toaster when I moved out of my last house I let them take this into a storage unit and the only thing I've been talking about is my toaster look at this it's an actual touchscreen toaster and you can see how, how you want to toast it and it literally comes out like the picture best feature of this house for sure and we got the fridge. I've always wanted my own fridge to just make it look aesthetically pleasing. And you now we got drinks of all kind. Water is key. Chug rug is key. For all my friends, whatever they want, anything unhealthy. Noah, I know you like that Calypso blue lemonade. Oh, you get me away from this. Yeah, right? <laughs> and here is the walk-in pantry. I actually did a little bit of shopping yesterday. Damn. Dude, I love my cereal. <laughs> I told you, we did a cereal tier list. I love cereal. So my top three in here is definitely gotta be Honey Bunches of Oats. You guys 
guys probably think I'm weird. Lucky Charms. Honestly, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Gotta respect it. We got another fridge in here and we got all the cabinets. There's a lot of space for my snacks. You already know. Hey, would you guys let me snack shop for you? I'll fill up your pantry and make it look real good. You got me? You already know. Okay. Look at that clap, bro. That was one more time, one more time. Oh, oh. it's over. <laughs> Okay, so all I'm gonna say is the backyard is the greatest backyard of all time. It's a dream backyard. It's pure entertainment out there. So should we go to it now or no, should we no, save no. it for last? Save it for last. I want you to just get a view of this side because we didn't really get a good look at the couch. Got the Mirakami pillows. We got the cause. Everything pops in this room because it's so modern and everything is white. So any pop of color, it just stands out so much. I'm definitely gonna be spending a lot of time in the living room. One of my favorite pieces right here, the cover of Sports Illustrated with a bunch of legends. Literally one of the greatest accomplishments of my life. Shout out to FaZe Clan. So we're gonna walk down the hall. Here is one of my favorite rooms as well. <laughs> this is gonna be my ping pong room. We added this 77 inch TV so we can watch, you know, some basketball, watch some games in here while we're playing. And I just got uh, Mike and Sully. You know what Ooh, I mean? Look at that. Combo. This is my favorite one right here. And of course, my favorite art piece of all time, the GOAT, the Black Mamba Kobe Bryant in one of the most important rooms of the house, of course. I've been waiting for this moment for so long to move into a new house. You guys don't understand. Been talking about it for months and it's finally here. So there's a lot of guest bedrooms that I haven't done anything to because I just moved in. There's a lot of those. I'm not going to get too into it, but this is one of the guest rooms. This right here is actually a guest house. This is kind of where you put the bed, but then you enter into this side and you get a fridge, a kitchen, and another giant TV. I think I'm going to turn this into a lounge of some sort, like a movie theater lounge. We could have watch parties of Phase Rug videos. I mean, who wouldn't want to watch that, right? <laughs> when I tell you we have so much content planned, if you are not yet subscribed, I would appreciate you to hit that subscribe button. The content will not disappoint. So this is the garage. I don't want to show you guys because it's super dirty. We got a bathroom right here with another Kobe picture. So that is pretty much the entire downstairs. And what I love about this house the most is that it just feels really homey. My last house, I always felt really lonely in because it it was too big and it was one story. It was long. It was far away from everyone. At least right now I'm closer to my family. The vibe of this house just makes me feel more at home. So you're gonna walk upstairs. The first thing you see is this phase custom picture frame basketball hoop. This was gifted to me for 20 million subs. Look at how long the hallway is, bro. Holy. I know, dude. Like, I like how everything is split in between one and two stories. You guys ready for the master bedroom? Here we go. So right when you walk in, there's a little mini bar. Added some accessories up here. We got a fridge down there. And guys, a lot of this house isn't complete yet. I put all the main stuff in for this house tour, but you're gonna see a lot, a lot of renovations. This is it right here, dude. Mr. Tom, I got this yesterday. Matches the vibe of the house. Got the TV in, and then we got this balcony overlooking the backyard. We can't really, let's just go out there. Let's do it, come on. Look at how giant this balcony is. Waking up, grabbing a cup of coffee, starting off the day like this is really inspiring and motivating. This is the view of the backyard. Don't, maybe let's not show it. <laughs> let's not show it, but you guys, you guys probably saw a little bit of it. Oh my gosh. I am so freaking happy. I'm so excited. You guys all made this possible. I want you all to understand that. We're about to enter the master bath. We got this custom rug made by Simji Official. She is extremely talented with rugs, and I just think it pops in the bathroom floor. We got a bathtub, you know, a his and her sink. Now, the craziest part is how big the shower is. You can literally run a marathon in here, bro. Check it out. <laughs> Look at how long it is. Oh. That's actually crazy. Yeah, walk with me in. Come on, what are you doing? Oh, it's a mirror too? Lots of room for activities. Definitely a lot of activities in here. <laughs> and then you get two closets. This is the one I'm using for now. I'm hoping I can fit all my shoes. I put some of them in already. This is a big deal for me, guys. I've been living with my family for the past like six months. And once again, I love living with my family. But once you've already lived by yourself and experienced the freedom, it's really hard to go back. But now that I have my own spot, it's pretty close to them. I feel really, really happy. I feel good about it. Just look at the chandelier. This this is nuts. The view from here is just absolutely incredible. Anytime I make videos like this, guys, it's never for the intention of bragging. I hate bragging. This is more to inspire my audience that if you put in a lot of work for what you love, this can actually happen. This can come true. Like this all started with video games for me. When I was 14 years old, playing video games for 12 hours a day resulted into this. It's a lot of hard work, a lot of patience. So I don't know. I just hope you guys get inspired by my content. So at the end of the hallway, we got 
the laundry room. I've never really seen a laundry room upstairs, but it's different. It's cool. All of these bedrooms upstairs are empty, but I do have some plans. This was actually supposed to be my gaming room, but the internet situation, like they didn't have an ethernet cord. I don't know. So this was supposed to be it, but this is actually connected to another room. I think it's called a Jack and Jill. <laughs> I don't know. I'm starting to learn these tours. I literally feel like a real estate agent right now, giving you guys a tour. So as you can see, we have a clean sink, white with the marble top, full length mirror. And as you can see behind this too, we got a toilet and a shower. Wow. Dude, look at how close it is to the toilet. Ready? <laughs> Imagine it just hit it. And of course it goes into another guest bedroom. Not sure what I want to do with this yet. Do you guys have any cool ideas of what you think I should do with the empty rooms? Let me know. Now this right here is going to be turned into the ultimate gaming setup. I already talked to someone who's going to make it crazy. I'm going to be streaming twitch.tv slash rug, making some gaming videos and just having fun. Me and Noah have been talking about opening a reaction channel. Yes, we have to do that this year. The motivation is through the roof right now. You guys have pretty much seen the entire house the inside it's time for the backyard let's do it oh my god oh my god dude so what I was looking for in a new house when I was house searching was something that will keep me happy and entertain the whole time. A big backyard is something that I want because I have so many plans and this right here is the one Sheesh. Dude, this is a dream, dream backyard. I can't stress it enough. It looks absolutely beautiful. And this right here is a little patio area hangout. Had to bring out some basketball. You already know, pop a shot. First shot, that's fine. Second shot, that's also fine. Third time to charm. All right. All right, that counts. We're gonna start off on the right side because the best part is on the left side. We got a mini golf course. Look at this, an entire putting green. And I had that at my last house, but they actually got the sand here. They got the <laughs> sand pit where the ball gets stuck, dude. It's literally just, this is crazy, man. The scenery out here is absolutely beautiful. If you could look to the right, all that green right there, super, super bright. And guys, just remember, think about all the content that's gonna be made in this house. So here is one of my favorite parts guys one of my favorite is this little gazebo area so we're gonna have a lot of barbecues here a lot of family parties all that stuff a lot of collabs in the works we got this chill hangout area where we're definitely gonna be watching a lot of sports NBA finals movies YouTube videos everything in this area and check out how big it is like this area right here is definitely one of the coolest parts of the house all right we're working our way here a lot of grass space not sure what I want to put here yet but for now I'm gonna keep it empty but check out this fire pit fire Fire. Literally fire. It looks like a bunch of broken glass, but I love it. It is, it is. Wait, is it? Yeah. Bro, I don't know if like they made this to like fit with all these people, but like I don't have this many friends, bro. <laughs> like, like, like how many people will this fit? Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like 16 people. That's a vibe. Hey, that's why I got my beautiful family too. Noah, you're a part of that. Hey. Love you, bro. Love you too. Okay, we're moving on to the freaking swimming pool, man. When I tell you the summertime is gonna be crazy, look at how giant this pool is, bro. It's beautiful, bro. Swim Swimming here in the summer and not only swimming, but like just making content with this pool is freaking crazy. You can see the hot tub too. It's in the middle of it. I'm already breaking like things, bro. Right? I'm already breaking <laughs> But yeah, the hot tub, pretty decent size. This looks like uh, where a bunch of Instagram models would be like taking pictures. Oh yeah, 100%. Mountains in the back, ain't no service in the mountains. Yeah, no, that's what I love too, guys. Like there's personal preference with views. Like a lot of people like ocean views. I'm more of a mountain kind of guy because like the privacy. You're a love mountain it. boy. I'm a mountain boy. <laughs> Stop, 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 bro. There is already a freaking basketball court here. Right when I saw this in the backyard, it was a done deal for me, guys. So, of course, knowing me, I'm gonna customize this court. But real quick, you know the drill, point to a spot. <laughs> Imagine this, first time on camera. If I make this, it's annoying when I ask for life. So, you guys just know what to do. Oh. Imagine it bounced in. So you guys all know how my last court looked. Here's a picture if you haven't seen it. For this one, I actually want to make this subscriber themed. Oh. I don't know how. I want to make it like a Rugrats themed court. And I want to incorporate you guys with it. Like there's a way you guys could like sign something. We could put like signature. Or maybe we could do like an art contest. Oh, I like that. Little art contest. You guys submit it. And the winner is like how my court is going to be designed. Yeah. It's a good idea, no? I'm going to give this one more shot. All right, so <laughs> what I'm thinking, there's one of two things that I want to do. Either turn this into a half court or, <laughs> you already know what I'm going to say, right? Full court? Mm hmm Two things I could do. One, I really want to put like a soccer goal here and maybe have like one-on-ones. 
So that's one idea. Or the second one is to literally extend the basketball court and make it a full court. I don't really play soccer. It's probably gonna be the second option. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> probably, yeah. So real quick, before we leave the backyard and end the video, I just wanna get a good view facing the whole backyard because I feel like something to admire for sure. Guys, I just wanna say I'm feeling extremely thankful, extremely blessed for all of your support and making this possible. This is literally my dream home. I know a lot of people think I'm gonna sell it in a few months or I'm gonna move back in with my mom and dad. Like that's fine for people to have those opinions. But when I tell you I actually mentally feel good in this house and I didn't in my past houses, I'm speaking truthfully. All I care about is my mental health and I feel great. I feel so excited for the future. If you guys are not yet subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. The future content will not disappoint you. Please honestly just leave your feedback in the comment section down below. I'm gonna be reading a ton of comments on what you guys think. All right, you already know I love you guys and here is to the future.